I'm Rasha Maples with KHQA, and we are getting ready for the League of Women Voters of Adams County Candidates Forum, which is this Tuesday, and I'm joined now by John McCoy. He is a candidate for Adams County Sheriff, and we're just going to ask a few questions in preview of that Candidates Forum. First question, John, sure. uh, why do you want to become the next Adams County Sheriff? Well, as you know, being in the news, uh, you've noticed in the last few years the uptake in uh, violent crimes the murders, the shootings, the drug overdoses, and now to compound on that is the heroin deaths that we're experiencing in this community. I think that one thing that really alarmed me uh, was a couple of years ago or a year and a half ago uh, when a 12-year-old child was gunned down. Some of the headlines didn't sound like the same area that I remember. Uh, I raised my family here, and my family is now raising their family here. Um, I don't like what I see. Uh, I know with my background and my experience, we have had those similar um, upticks in violence before, and all of this is drug driven. Um, and when I talk about heroin, that's not something made in the back seat of a car. That's something that's imported in here from outsiders bringing um, that deadly product into our community. Just in the last couple of weeks, we've had two young people pass away from drug overdoses, um, and they were both. Uh, I believe heroin. I know one was. Um, when I'm talking to medical uh, personnel, they're telling me that I'm right on target. Um, the, uh, the overdoses in the hospital and the heroin deaths are off the chart for here. It doesn't seem like um, the same place that I remember. And I want to do something about it. And like I said, my background and my experience is unique, the, the uniquely qualifies me to be the sheriff. Um, I can say that I, I was a 28-year veteran, and that's fine. It's what you did uh, and accomplished in that 28 years is the important question. Um, I had the best training uh, that the world has to offer in law enforcement. I'm an FBI Academy graduate out of Quantico, Virginia. It's what, how you utilize that training is, is the most important question. In that, uh, I was the lead investigator for 20 years on all the major cases all homicides, crimes against persons, and major thefts. Um, I have the background to show that. The first task force ever put together in this area was a four-man team, two, two from Quincy uh, Police Department and two from the Adams County Sheriff's Department. I was one of those original four. So I've had the background starting from the ground zero. I came up through the ranks. I was a deputy, and a sergeant, and a chief deputy for 17 and a half years. I have the leadership and quality to make an impact on what we're facing today. Um, and I think it's important to have all that because if you lead by example, you have an example to lead by. And I think that we have to be more aggressive and, and attack this problem. Uh, like I said, our youth are the ones that's paying for it. Um, I raised my family here. Everybody else is raising their family here. I hate seeing what's going on. Why should people choose you to become the next Adams County Sheriff? For the same reasons I just touted. Um, I think that we need to make this a safer place. Um, it concerns me. Uh, this kind of violence uh, is brought about by uh, almost 100% of the drug uh, addictions going on and the drug trafficking. And I intend to make that my number one priority is going after drug dealers and especially the heroin trade that's coming in here. And I have ways of doing that. I have ways of combating that. I've done that before, and I'll do it again. And as the com campaign rolls on, um, I'll be more specific of how I'll do that. And last question, what would you like to accomplish if you were elected to become the next Adams County Sheriff? Well, the one thing I would address right away is one of the concerns I hear from the real people is having um, more uh, visibility out in the county. Um, the other thing is to beef up uh, the West Central Illinois Task Force, a part of what I just said. Um, I was one of the original uh, four in that. Um, and I want to make it a safer place again. Uh, we went from uh, being uh, an all-American all city to um, being ranked on a, on a list that we don't want to be on. Um, I saw one list put out by the Uniform Crime Report, and it compiles also the um, population size where it puts us right behind uh, Decatur, Illinois. Um, we shouldn't even be on that list, and I want to change that.
All right. Thank you, John McCoy. Again, the League of Women Voters of Adams County Candidates Forum is Tuesday, September 27th at the First Christian Church in Quincy. We'll see you then.